Well, happy to announce we have some DX here in Newfoundland, Canada. Uh, currently listening to Channel 38, Lower Side. We have a local, Dave, 9 Tango Charlie 185. There he is. He's uh, calling out to some DX here. Just turned on the radio, so she needs a few more minutes to warm up and get everything on to go here. We've not had condition here in some time, although I did hear somebody, some of the locals saying that there was some intermittent DX, but we have it on to go now. Looking very promising, folks. Got the clarify right on zero now. Take a peek down to uh, 36 for a second. Not pretty quite there again. For those of you who don't know, Dave is uh, about 20 kilometers north of me on the other side of the bay. In St. George's Bay, uh, Bay St. George, as it's probably more commonly known. He's uh, 20 kilometers north of me. And uh, yeah, he's doing a wonderful trip here. He's uh, certainly uh, doing 20 over here. Well, you know DX is in when you get some uh, some people having lots of fun with the sugar crisp. Uh, that sugar crisp is no good for you. That sugar crisp is no good for you. It will rot your teeth right out of your mouth, no doubt about it. 11.85, Newfoundland, Canada said that. Okay, he's calling 11.85. <coughs> Excuse me. Uh, 11.85, I'm not sure what group that is uh, with. Um, anyway. He's certainly still doing a good signal, no matter what group he's in. Uh, Dave is in uh, Stephenville, Newfoundland. And that's Canada. For those of you that may be in another dimension altogether, Dave uh, does, certainly does a lot of uh, skip shooting. 
when it's in. So uh, it's a very, uh, a very good day for it, and it's a pleasure listening to Dave. It's always a pleasure. He's a sincere CB gentleman. I'm going to make this video uh, um, a little bit short. I think we're at about five minutes. Yeah, five minutes and 24, 24 seconds. I don't like to make them too long because people sort of lose uh, interest after a certain amount of time. I'm going to shut up now in case somebody might be watching the video and could hear themselves uh, in this video gate. Okay, it's WWS. Whoa. Wow. I don't know if that was a local or not, but he uh, had a good signal. We'll see. I know you all got a sloppy copy. I know you all got a sloppy copy on this mud up station here in Newfoundland, Canada. No doubt about it. Bring her back to 1185. We're trying. Hello. Yeah, conditions aren't supreme, but it's going to get a lot better than this. It's kind of in and out there now. It's like boom and bust. It comes in heavy and then it drops out. Be nice if people would use their call signs more often than for video gates. You could better identify who it is, but some people just use numbers, and um, it takes a while to actually get any information of them. They just use their numbers when they're shooting skip. So I recommend just my recommendation: identify yourself as best as possible. Four two zero North Central Florida. I think that's what he just said. Need to shut up my mouth and let you guys listen. It is, uh, by the way, seven. 7.44 p.m. Uh, local time here in Newfoundland. And it's getting dark out. The sun's just about down altogether. So conditions are still on the go. I just got in to check the radio, so not um, probably not the best time to be doing a video gate here, but, uh, but uh, we, we captured it just the same. Great stuff. So we got uh, Florida, Alabama. That guy sounds like a local. Wow, signals are coming back in. Anybody that can identify themselves in this video gate, by the way, if you're listening, or feel free to uh, leave a comment in the video or email me. You can find my email on my uh, YouTube channel. Feel free to contact me if you'd like. It's a pleasure listening to everybody. Uh, I prefer listening more than talking, actually. Especially when I get to hear some locals talking. Just drop down to 36 again. Yeah, it's pretty good. Like I say, it's better than nothing. It's been very quiet here for the longest time. I 
think we're at 10 minutes. Wow, time flies when you're having fun. Gonna shut down this video now, folks. I'd let it run longer. Uh, like I say, but I don't want to blow out your attention span there. Uh, maybe some other time I'll probably run a lot longer video, but just want to uh, get a little kick at the can here and let you know. Let you know that the DX is rolling. Get your radios ready. We got a few years left in this this uh, upcoming cycle, cycle 25. Get yourself a radio and an antenna and get on the air. That was a good time. Any of you interested in uh, joining the CB group? I'm a member of the. Uh, Transcontinental DX Group, based out of uh, Canada. Uh, I am 9 Tango Charlie 02. You want to Google uh, TCDX or Transcontinental DX, and you will see some information online about the group. Jim Curry, 9 Tango Charlie 01, based out of Alberta, is the president, and uh, make contact with him. Get yourself a number, and we've got some crests, t-shirts, QSL cards, you name it, different things like that. Uh, we're certainly interested in uh, some quality members, people who are interested in uh, radio locally and DX is all good. Uh, we are a sideband group, so uh, if you're interested in our local channel, uh, it's uh, 36, uh, lower sideband. And that's just a little plug for the uh, for the group, uh, TCDX group. Uh, big history. Uh, Jim has been at the helm for a long time with this group, and of course with the uh, DX rolling again, it looks like the the group is going to be expanding once again and uh, picking up new members. So if you're considering uh, joining a group, give us some consideration. 73 is all. Hope you enjoyed a little bit of DX.